Hello Superherd and welcome back to LEGO Worlds and today we're going to be going ahead and showing off more add-on content that's available in the game right now. It is the LEGO Ninjago add-on content and that's pretty, I guess, relevant because there's a lot of LEGO Ninjago stuff going on recently. Of course, you might know that the LEGO Ninjago movie came out and then along with it, the Le LEGO Ninjago movie video game. I actually made a video on the LEGO Ninjago movie video game already, but if you want to see that, it'll be linked either in the description or on the card in the top right or at the end stream at the end of the video, all that kind of stuff, and uh, yeah, pretty cool. But today, we're gonna be showing off all the DLC that came to LEGO World to celebrate the launch of the LEGO Ninjago movie, and that should be somewhere around here. You can get this, of course, on the main menu, just like you can all the other add-on content, but do keep in mind that they don't stay around forever. You're gonna be quick with it. So we have the Ninjoid Patrol, we have the Master Wu's Dojo, we have the Ninjago Bamboo Forest, not Ninjago, Ninjago Bamboo Forest, and then the Monster Chapel, which actually is for something else. We got the Samurai Cave, and the Samurai VXL site, and I think that's everything, looks like it. So, let's go ahead and start spawning some of that stuff in. We'll adventure it all, we'll try to find as many things as we can within it. I figured it wouldn't be that big of a deal to spawn it in around this area, but there are a lot of animals in this biome, so maybe you wanna switch to somewhere else. For right now, though, this is looking pretty cool. Actually, not too much to it as I thought, but hey, Yoon, what do you want? You want something, hello. <laughs> Finally, we have a weapon to defeat our enemies. Unfortunately, there is only one available to us, and those sneaky ninjas keep coming at me from all angles. If only there was a way to place more tripods down. Then I could defend myself. Do you think you could help me, warrior? I could, oh yeah, okay, so I have to place this down, and there's a big old chest here. 10,000 for the unlock, ooh. So we should have that now. Um, you need five of them, huh? Well, if I uh, copy, I should be able to place one, and then we'll place them in like different directions so that we're prepared from all angles. But we need five of them, huh? So there we go, that's good enough for him. It's good enough for me. So I can actually go ahead and discover you as well. You are a, uh, something. Let me go ahead and check that out. We will go ahead and find out together by going like that. But yeah, that's why it's definitely worth getting these things. Not only do you get a bunch of studs, you get a whole bunch of new items and cool Ninjago characters like a Ninjoid. So we'll be him for now because it seems weird to be a firefighter while we're doing a whole bunch of Ninjago stuff. So let's go here. And where's that Ninjoid at? He might actually be closer to the bottom. We got a lot of characters, so it takes a while to get through everything. Um, No, I definitely missed him. Oh, he's right here. Okay. so. I got him, he looks so cool, he's ready to fight, whoa. I can only imagine these characters have some really nice combat, there is a troublemaker I don't care about too much. Really, I'm just worried about discovering some stuff, a lot of cool little um, bamboo, all that kind of stuff. This is also a cool weapon. Yeah, we can sit on this and start shooting. That is very cool, I like that. So, doesn't shoot very quickly, but it does you know, seem to have some decent auto aim to it, so that's good. Okay, I don't, I don't wanna, I don't, I, okay. I just don't want to ride anything anymore. Get me off of this crazy thing! <laughs> right, I really don't care about the troublemaker, but maybe we'll get him if we run into him properly. There's some weird rock statues, small bamboo, large bamboo. Okay, and I think that's everything. Yep, okay, so let's go ahead and get our chest, which we'll hopefully have. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, so many studs. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, we're showering in the dough. 500,000 studs, man oh man. If you ever needed just free stuff, that's where you get it. Oh my gosh. You can only do that once. You can't spawn it over and over again. But still, it's still a free 500,000 studs. You might as well go ahead. So there is the Ninjoid Patrol. Really awesome. Now we have the Master Wu's Dojo, which is right here. So let's go like that. Place this bad boy down. Also, this might be the, uh, the first LEGO Worlds episode in 60 frames per second, opposed to normal 30. And that'll be pretty cool. Oh, hey, this Master Wu. What does he need? Uh-oh, we got some bad guys as well. Can I just discover you? Um, not yet. Oh, you're a bad guy though. Are you gonna beat me up? Or are you gonna beat up Master Wu? Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hey, hey! Oh, Master Wu's getting it! Here you go, boom. There you go, get out of here. Uh, I wish I could uh, maybe talk to him first. Okay, he's got it un under control. Like, I'm trying to help him out, but he, he moves too quick for me. What is he doing running over there? Master Wu is definitely in trouble here though, but if I help him out and destroy enough of these evil bad dudes, maybe that'll be what I need to do. This guy fell down. So, uh, oh, he's in the water, okay. Can I get him? Oh, I got him, that sniper shot! A ninjoid helps out Master Wu, what do you know? Okay, so let's go ahead and quickly discover him before he runs away. Now it's a game of like, 
catch the Wu. All right, oh, I wanna be Master Wu now. Let's go ahead and check that out. He should be, um, yeah, no, I was doing the right thing. He should be here. Oh, there he is, 25,000, he's an expensive master, but you know what? Sometimes you gotta pay up if you wanna be the master. I'll discover that, because it's just in my peripheral vision. So where's Master Mu, Master Mu? <laughs> master Wu is right next to the Ninjoid. Very cool. So I have most of these things because they're actually not a part of this. Oh, these are cool windows, I like these. These are a lot of really interesting building materials here. That's it, oh, okay. I just, I already have that one. Hmm, and the rest of it seems to be bricks. Very, very cool, I like that. So let's open this up. Ooh, it's nice in here. I wanna discover as much as I can. Lots of cool ninjas if you can make your own ninja dojo out of all this, that's very cool. I can only imagine some cool, really fun builds. Okay, I do not want a cow in here, please and thank you. <laughs> I love how you can close them as well. You could probably make a lot of cool builds out of everything that you're gonna get in this DLC. So I do suggest, I think that this stuff definitely isn't here forever. I think it goes away sometime in November. So make sure you go ahead, go into Lego Worlds and download stuff. I know that the Lego City stuff I showed off last episode, already gone, so make sure you go and do that. It is all limited time stuff. So if I go up here, what are we gonna find? Um, This dojo bust, oh, okay, I already had it. Here's a bed, a cool dojo bed, a chest, and a dojo potted plant. So will this give me another 500,000? Wow, that was a cool attack. I might have to check out everybody, all of our new characters, all of their attacks. Maybe towards the end of the video right now, I'm focused a little more on exploring, but that was, actually, that was a little bit less. That was only about 100,000 studs there, right? Or maybe a little less, maybe like 80,000. That's okay, not the end of the world. We still got a ton of studs. Uh, so let's move on to our next building, which should be, we go here, we did Master Wu's Dojo, now we got the Ninjago, Ninjago, that's like a weird tongue twister for me. Ninjago Bamboo Forest. Sorry, chicken and cow, if I displaced you from your natural habitat. You know, there's plenty left of it. It's gonna be a very active world I have here, because I have all this, like I have the town and the bunch of Lego City stuff, a random house is just over here for no reason. Still don't understand that one. Wow, this is crazy. Now, some of this bamboo, I don't have it yet. It's like super tall. It's hard to tell which ones I do have and which ones I don't, but I guess I could remove them to find out, and I could just sort of hope that I do. Like, I could just sit here and spam A as much as I possibly can, and I guess I'll eventually find out, right? Um, but it's not the end of the world if I miss a couple. It is sort of <laughs> confusing, but it's okay. So what's going on around here? We got you. Oh, are you, what's your name? Can't discover you just yet. You're, you're Zane, you're Cole. Is that all that we got around here? We also have Kai, and then we also have Jay. I think we have like the whole the whole squad here. And I hope they don't run off too far. Oh, there was the entrance to the bamboo dojo, or bamboo forest. How do I, what quest do I need to do for you dudes? Because I definitely want to do it. Hmm. I mean, you'd think they would just bow down. Oh, here we go. Because, we're, you know, we're Master Wu. I see Master Wu sent a new warrior to us. It's Master Wu. Welcome. We are training hard to battle the forces of evil. That just also happens to be my dad. But nevertheless, we are strong, vigilant, and ever ready. Are you prepared to train the, in the secret arts of the ninja? Excellent. Then let's start by making a training area. We need more equipment here if we are to train today. You should start by placing ho some training dummies over near Kai and Jay. Think you can handle that? Okay. So we'll do that in just a moment. Oh geez, more of these guys are attacking you? There we go, I helped out a little bit, but um, I already have Master Wu. I, I wonder if I can discover some of these. I can't. wonder what I need to do to discover the bad guys. Maybe we'll find out in another one, but we need, I think I actually have both of those, but if not, it's pretty simple. I'm sure we could find them around here. And do I have this? I do, I just need to unlock it. So I'm gonna go ahead and copy that and place it here and here and until I hear the uh, check mark go off, but I also need to find more room. Did I do it yet? Why are you walking away? Uh, Four out of three, okay, so I did it, I did it. Um, so we'll go ahead and discover that. We already have this discovered, but we can go ahead and, no. There we go. There we go, we did it, awesome. So there's that quest done, and then we can discover this thing back there. So can we go talk to you really quick? Um, was it one too many? You need exactly three? There you go, okay, I guess he needs exactly three. Four is too much, so it doesn't count. All right, thank you. So I can go ahead and discover you if you don't walk away. Oh, wait, I said, don't walk away. Don't, there you go. <laughs> no, my studs! Yeah, I got him. So this one actually doesn't seem to have a chest unless I'm just not looking very far. 
Now, can I discover you guys? I can't. Oh, so I can do a quest for all of them. That's awesome. Luckily, they stay in place pretty well. Hey there, newbie. I know we should be training with those dummies, but what kind of training is that? Boring. Now, training with weapons is much more fun. Thing is, I kind of skipped out on breakfast this morning, rocking my tunes, or rocking to my tunes, so I'm in no shape to train. Tell you what, I'll tell you my weapon, or I'll, I'll let you use my weapon in exchange for some food. How about it? Sure, you want chicken? We got a drumstick. Master Wu always has a drumstick. You, you kidding me? Okay, so I can store for that. That's very cool. And then, more importantly, I get to an unlock you, I get to discover you. So we're getting the entire Ninjago team. Now, who do we talk to next? Oh, is there? <laughs> All right, Master Wu has no problem catching such a silly little uh, troublemaker. Unfortunately, okay, there's his block. I was gonna say, I think we might already have this block. We do not. Okay, so we need to talk to you next. Hello. Oh, hey, a new recruit? Funny, I must have missed that memo. You look oddly like Master Wu. <laughs> anyway, I see you're here to train with the best of the best, which just so happens to be me. I'm pumped and ready to fight bad guys, are you? Great, you can start by showing me your moves on those dummies over there. Go on, really let them have it. Okay, so these, so I need to break them? Yeah, okay, so I just need to make, actually, you know what's funny is I think technically I could do that or I could just remove them. Interesting. I like how that works. So the idea is just you're just supposed to remove them from the environment. But I could go on ninja on them if I wanted to. But I'm master stinking woo. I'll do whatever I want. Don't you run away from me. I gotta discover you. Okay, so now it's your turn. How you doing? Whoa, you're awesome, newbie. Great job smashing those dummies like a pro. Welcome to the team. You've gotten the moves. You just need a decent weapon now. Okay. Hope you didn't get too attached to that training sword, because I've got something much more suited to a ninja of your skills, a ninja sword. Ooh, you're just gonna toss it to me. Oh, we're trading. Cool, right? Looks like it. It looks exactly the same, but it does say ninja sword. Actually, it doesn't look exactly the same, now I'm getting a better look at it. Okay, let's discover you. That was a really easy one, so I just think we need, well, there's two of you. Um, Let's talk to you first. Hello there, and welcome to my dojo. I have trained, uh, Many students in the ways of the ninja, even now my students are out protecting the innocent, but I fear something is coming. A group known as the Anachondri have been seen and it is up to us to stop them. Okay, I thought I already did that. We, we sort of did. I just didn't actually get to read the quest name. I really just wanna, you know, unlock some of these guys. So maybe I should uh, pull out my ninja sword and get the slicing, huh? Boom, boom, boom. Wow, that is so cool, I love that get over here, and I'm just gonna run to all the yellow arrows and do whatever I'm supposed to do. But yeah, I'd love to hear your thoughts on the Lego Ninjago movie and video game. Like I said, I've already played a little bit of the game, still haven't seen the movie. I I'm a busy zebra. I usually can't go to theaters too much, because one thing, they're super expensive. Like, I don't know, I just feel like I sh Oh my gosh! <laughs> that was scary, you scared me, man. Um, But yeah, I just, I don't know, I'd rather spend the money with uh, on better things, you know? I mean, I'll be able to eventually watch the movie, right? So that's sort of the thing. Okay, so now we gotta go ahead and help you. I think you're the last one. Greetings and congratulations on becoming a ninja. Celebrations commencing in three, two, one. Yeah, you're the robot. Wait, I am detecting several anaconda in the vicinity. Well, new ninja, it looks like you'll be, you'll really need, uh, get to test your skills now. Be wary, they could be hiding amongst the bamboo. So chop it down to find them. Let's go kick some posterior. Okay, so, oh, let's help you out a little bit. Oh, okay, I don't wanna beat you up myself. That wanna be good. I think I'd be kicked from the ninja team if I beat them up. Okay, so I got that. If I go over here, I can beat up this one. Or does ninja dude or robot dude got him? Maybe. All right, there you go. So I can I can go ahead and discover you. Awesome. So I think that's everyone. Unless I'm forgetting or missing somebody. That lamb wants a carrot, but I'm not really worried too much about that one. Yeah, I think that's everybody. I think we got all of the Ninjago team here, which is great. So, I wanna back up a little bit and we're gonna move to our next environment. We'll place it somewhere over here. That sounds just fine for me. So, get our discoveries. We did the bamboo forest. If we move down here, that's the monster chapel. That's for the monster steel. See, I'll show that off then. Um, jungle temple rune is not that. We already showed that off. I think there's one more, right? Samurai cave, that's it. There's samurai cave and then there's the samurai VXL site. So we still have two more. Plenty more fun things to happen here. I love it. Okay, so this thing, whoa, this thing's like way bigger than I thought it was gonna be. I might have to give it a second to build. Okay, so it's all nice and built, which is great. I can get up here, that scarecrow wants a water gun. I'm not really interested in giving it to him at the moment. What is going on here? So there's not too much going on at the top, but I hear somebody jumping around inside. Is this a bad guy's place or a good guy's? Well, there's you. Hello. 
Oh, hello there. I'm here defending my super secret cave from sneaky intruders. One of those Kulkins to get in here. Ha <laughs> ha. Wait, did you hear that? Oh no. They're rising up out of the floor. Quick, let's go. Oh my. Well, not the floor, like the cave. Which is, I guess, our ceiling, right? Or not. Uh, where is he? He's like stuck inside. All right, well, let's first get you. <laughs> They're glitchy skeletons. Oh no. Wow, they are really glitchy skeletons. You get back here, sir. I'm not done with you. Oh, get the sword out. Mmm, good. Luckily, we have, you know, max health, so that makes things helpful. How do I get, okay. Where is this dude? Is he like stuck? He's like stuck inside, okay. Um, I'll help you out so that I can destroy him. There you go. Oh, oh my gosh, he's brutal. Well, we found the super chest, awesome. Wow, that was a ton of stuff. That was like at least a good couple hundred thousand there. All right, we don't even need the sword. I will try out all the characters, so don't worry about that. I just wanna sort of de get the missions done and unlock them all before we show them all off. There we go, come on, come on. Let me pull out the weapon again, because the sword is just so helpful for doing a ton of damage. Like, it's really good combat-wise. There we go, we got you. You look angry. Oh yeah, I guess you're the, other, you're the only member of the uh, Ninjago team we haven't gotten. I forget your name. No, I wanted to discover her, silly. Unlock, there you go. So very, very cool. We'll go ahead and discover whatever else I could find around here, but that seems to be it. Hmm, discover that. Discover small cave computer. We just got that. So I think we're getting just about everything around here except for the thing I totally destroyed. Oh, I don't think that's too big of a deal. So there is that little cave done. So we got one more thing to do, which is the Samurai XLV something something. I hope that didn't go over the cave a little bit. It looks like we just barely missed it, oh gosh. Okay, that's fine with me, we made it work. Wow, there's tons of stuff going on here. I think I'm gonna, ooh. Go for the chest first down. Whoa, okay, that's a lot, that's a whole lot. Definitely that first chest gave us the most, but these are giving us, we jumped from two million to three million studs in today's video. So I can't get Master Chen just yet. Do I have to fight him? Because I know some characters you have to fight him to get them. It does look like he has health. Okay, it's Master Wu versus bad guy. We got him, we got him. There we go, discover him. Awesome, so there is this guy. Instantly forgot his name. I said discovering. Discovering. Yay. Now where's this bad dude? Can't get you just yet. What do I gotta do for you? I gotta make you mad, huh? Okay. We're so good at combat though. It's like so easy. And discover you as well. So I have discovered him, right? It still says discovered. This is being a little glitchy, ain't it? Um Discovered. Maybe I have to beat him up again. Maybe that one didn't count. Yeah, go for him. Go for him. Boom. Boom. Oh no, he blew up for real. Oh gosh, that's bad. I don't know why I'm not discovering him. Let's also get this. It seems to be some kind of cool new car. Uh, we'll discover a bunch of this other stuff as well, just so it's out of the way. Um, More bamboo, it's like doubled bamboo. Okay. But I think that's about everything. Nothing crazy new here. Yeah, I think so. Okay, well, we'll leave it at that, and that is all the uh, different kinds of uh, Environments that are available so far. I don't think they're adding any more. I think that's the extent of the like, Ninjago DLC. From my knowledge, you know, if they add more, I'll include them in whatever next video we make. So let me check everything out. If we go over here, we can check out all the new characters. You know, so far we've gotten Zane, we've gotten Master Wu, we've gotten Naya, we have gotten Lloyd, Kai, Jay, Cole, Anacondrine, and Ninjoid. Okay, so we still haven't gotten Master what's a who's its The guy we just beat up that I won't let me discover him. So that's a problem. I might spawn this environment back in an additional time. Let's go ahead and try that, and maybe I can just beat him up again. That's not the right one, is it? No, it's not. Whoopsies. Um, where is it? It is right here. So we'll try to spawn it in one more time and see if that maybe gets me the dude. Because I, I run it, really want to get all the characters. If not, He's the only character we can't show off, and one's not too big of a deal, right? So where is he? See, if I attack this chest out, just to you know, show you, it doesn't give you anything anymore. So if we go over here and we just beat you up, maybe? There we go. So discover him, discover him. Still nothing. Huh, definitely a weird glitch there. You guys can let me know if that's happening to you. I don't know what this vehicle is called, but we'll check that out now. It is a Samurai VXL. Let's ride this thing around. Now there are actually some other Ninjago stuff that actually came with the launch of Lego Worlds. How do I back up? There you go. Um, 
they are some, uh, I think it's like Cole's Digger and stuff like that. A lot of it was actually, you know, you could get it through cheat code. So I'll include that video probably in the card in the top right or at the end of the video. There's a video that shows off a whole bunch of awesome cool cheat codes for LEGO Worlds and some of them actually give you more LEGO Ninjago vehicles. So that's very, very cool if you wanna see that kind of stuff. This is a fun vehicle though. The only problem is that the uh, camera is a little too close. It's pretty fast, has some large wheels, so it doesn't have a problem getting over things. So finally, let's go ahead and check out all these characters that we have unlocked. We still nearly have three million coins, which is awesome. So first, we've been checking out Master Wu. He has some crazy awesome moves. He's really quick, very powerful. And then if we go back, let's start with Zane, because he just he's a character that shows up first. He is, of course, the robot. And he can tell you some very robotic moves. Nice, okay. I like it, we pulled up the sword, he has some crazy swords, because he doesn't feel as fast as Master Wu. That might just be um, me, though. So we can try out Naya here. She's very cool. I would be cool if at some point they include their giant, like, you know, robots that they have. Unfortunately, they haven't just yet, but ooh, maybe we'll be able to test things out on some zombies. I thought that you were gonna be a zombie. Oh, I'll beat you up anyways. Huh? <laughs> maybe that's a little mean to me. Let's do her slam down. Ooh, that is so cool. So let's go ahead and switch to Lloyd here. Now Lloyd is one of the more popular ones. He's like sort of like the leader, right? I would I would say yeah, he's sort of the leader. He has some really quick moves actually. I like that. And then we have Kai. It would be cool if like we could see each of their signature weapons cuz you know, I know that I don't think it's Kai, but I think it's a uh, the blue one. I think he usually has a big hammer, right? It would be cool if that was included. As far as I can see, that's not the case, but maybe I'm missing some stuff here. We got Jay here, I think Jay is the one with the big old hammer, if I'm not mistaken. Some of these guys have some similar moves, but of course it's to be expected eventually, right? Okay, so, let's keep going. Then we have Cole, he's pretty cool. He's, I guess he's he has the brown coloring. Ooh, ooh, I like that. Oh wow, yeah, he definitely has his own animations that look pretty nice. Cool, so. Let's keep moving on, we got the Anacondrine. I can only imagine that the master of this dude looks pretty similar, <laughs> but these guys sort of have a silly punch, like they punch and he sort of trips a little bit. <laughs> he has the butt slam, what is he, in Mario 64? <laughs> okay, very interesting. And then finally, we have the Ninjoin. Ninjoin was the very first character we unlocked. He's some kind of cool robot, ninja robot, awesome. So that's about everything, I think, for the uh, Lego Ninjago DLC. Stay tuned, because there will be an episode coming up soon showing off the brand new Lego Monsters DLC that will be available for Halloween. That'll be super duper fun. Like I said, there's actually a brand new buildable Lego Chapel that you can get as a free add-on right now. I think that's supposed to be a tie-in for Lego Monsters. It sort of seems spooky, so I'll be showing it off in that video if I can remember. For now, I think that'll finish it off. Thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Lego Worlds. If you watched this part of the video, make sure you comment Ninja a zebra, so now you've watched the end and that you are a zebra-tastic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now or by subscribing to join the zebra herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.